be able to work in a place which is full of sound disturbances and people shouting around? Would you be able to do and solve your mathematical problem in a place which has a lot of sounds, commotions, and a lot of disturbances? Today, I'm going to tell you a story about a person which is going to inspire and motivate you, and you will also think that, yes, I can. My name is Seanok, and you are watching Inspiring Stories on my channel, Physics for Students. Carl Schwarzschild was born on the 9th of October 1873 to a Jewish family. He studied physics and astronomy and he was appointed to work at the Göttingen Observatory which was under the Göttingen University. Although he was more than 39-40 years of his biological age, still he was appointed to serve in the army when the First World War broke out in 1914. He was doing ballistic calculations and he was raised to the position of a lieutenant. On 22nd of December 1915, Albert Einstein received a letter. Well, the envelope of this letter is full of mud, wrinkles and some of the places were full of blood stain. The letter reads as follows. As you see, the war is kindly disposed toward me, allowing me despite fierce gunfire at a decidedly terrestrial distance to take this walk into your land of ideas. This letter was from the bunker, from the trench of First World War and was written by Karl Schwarzschild. Well, this letter surprised Dr. Albert Einstein. The reason is that Schwarzschild has actually given the first exact solution of Einstein's field equations. Just imagine how difficult it was to solve 16 partial non-linear differential equations and that was during the war, that was under the trench when the war was fully going on. Karl Schwarzschild actually wrote three papers. Uh, out of that, two was on relativity and one was on quantum mechanics. Einstein was surprised because it was he that he created the Einstein field equations and only he could do a little bit of approximation. Schwarzschild has solved and presented before him the first exact solution of his Einstein's field equations. Uh, as we know that it later came to know as the Schwarzschild metric and from that the Schwarzschild black hole and other things evolved. And he solved it while uh, doing uh, his service under the gunfire, under the trench, under the terrible conditions when the war was going on. Today, physicists, uh, computer scientists, we use a lot of you know, calculations, we use a lot of software uh, and a lot of aids in order to solve Einstein's field equations. It was Schwarzschild who, under terrible conditions, staying in the trench, solved partial differential equations and gave Einstein the first exact solution. If Carl Schwarzschild can do this enormous calculation under a bunker when the war was going on, why can't you do this? Do you think that you always need a comfortable place where people are not talking, where there's absolute silence, you got a nice desk and a chair and you're doing your uh, studies, you're doing your calculations, you're doing your mathematics? Absolutely not. What you need is a little bit of concentration. What you need is complete absorption to the subject. And if Carl Schwarzschild can solve such difficult equations of Einstein's field equations under these conditions, I believe you can also do that. You can also concentrate under conditions which are not favorable when there are noises, problems, and people shouting around. I hope you like this story. I will be back with more inspiring stories in this channel, Physics for Students. This is Seanok signing off. Stay tuned for another inspiring story. Music